Hey guys, the Mona testnet has been on for a few weeks now and many people have been complaining that they do not have enough Mon to test the network. So in this video, I'll be showing you how to get an infinite number of Mon tokens for the Mona testnet. The first thing to do is to claim Sepulia Ed. There are several Sepulia Ed faucets. You'll find the link in the description and you should be getting at least one edge every day if you're using this process. You can also use testnet bridges to bridge your edge from server testnet like Arbitrum, Optimism, Base, and the likes to Sepulia. Once you've gotten Sepulia edge, bridge it to Mona testnet on Orbiter Finance. So on Orbiter Finance, click Connect Wallet. On EVM, click Connect. Select your preferred wallet and accept the connection request. Make sure that ETA is selected as the bridge token. So if ETA is not selected, click the drop down menu and select ETH. Make sure to select Sepulia as the network you're bridging from and make sure Monad is selected as the destination network. So you can search for Monad and you will see Monad testnet. If you can't select Monad testnet, use the link in the description and it should look like this. So you have your Sepulia as the source chain and Monad testnet as the destination chain. Enter the amount of Sepulia edge you want to bridge to Monad Sepulia and click bridge. Accept the request in your wallet and wait for the transaction to complete. So I'm bridging one Sepulia edge to get 0.995 Monad Sepulia edge. The transaction could take a few minutes to complete. So you can see my transaction here. 1.001F. Once your transaction is complete, you can use any DEX on Monad Testnet to swap Monad ETH to MON. For this example, I'll be using Ambient Finance. On Ambient Finance, you have to connect your wallet, click Connect Wallet, select your preferred wallet, and accept the connection request. Once you're connected, make sure you are on the swap page. So now enter the amount of ETH you want to swap. In this case, I'll enter one ETH. So with one ETH, I'm getting 0 0.9 MON. Click Approve ETH and accept the request in your wallet. Click Confirm, click Submit Swap and accept the request in your wallet. So now I've swapped one Monad ETH for about 0 0.9 MON. So guys, this is how to get MON for the Monad testnet using Sepulia X. If this video has helped you, like, comment, share and subscribe to my youtube channel if you have any issues ask for help in my telegram group the link to the group is in the description join my telegram channel for more mona testnet update including comprehensive guides for most of the ecosystem projects i'll be making guides on how to interact with several ecosystem apps so check out my channel regularly as i upload more videos or you can get started in the Telegram channel because I've already posted text guides a while ago for about 30 of this ecosystem project. If you haven't joined the Fraction AI testnet, check out this video at the top of your screen to help you get started. If you haven't joined the Ash Network testnet, check out this video at the top of your screen, follow the guide and get started. You will also find lots of other testnet in the bonus section of this video description. So check it out and join as many testnets as you can. So keep testing on Mona Testnet. Stay safe and I'll see you in the next video.